Hello, I'm here t today to tell you about my homemade tech. This is Rusty, 2007 limited edition. I got from my nan and granddad a couple of years ago now. Um, yeah, this is of course a plow tack, well, saddle sort of thing. I don't have a plow, I'm making one soon. I just need to get the right material and metal and stuff, and then it'll be done. Um, this is where you just do the girth up and it stays round just to hold the martingale which goes around the front and it goes underneath here as you can see just right here um this goes i know they usually don't go around the tail but i only did that for supervision goes along his back and wraps around his tail um and then i'm going to have some long reins from here on both sides so there as well going back and holding the plough when it's ready yeah that's that that's one thing out of the way um this is my new pony i got for christmas my little brown pony it's my dog barking, barking in the background <laughs> As you can see, he's a Rubian, sort of strawberry roanish. He's quite small. I don't think he's a traditional or a classic. Some people call. Yeah. Um. I got that for Christmas this Christmas, two thousand and eleven. This is a horse I got quite a couple of years ago this is my homemade showing hair collar as you can see I made I have this from paper chase and I slimmed it down cut it down the middle and I use double sided tape and paper clips stretch your paper clips out I would make a square or a circle shape. I'm not too good with circles, so I did squares. And then just make it. Um, as you can see, I made the buckles there. This one's a bit wonky, but it's alright. Yeah, and that's that. And here's my other one I made. This one's a little bit better than that one. Don't really know, you can't see the buckles at all, but oh well. Still looks quite good. Okay, that's it. Thank you. And um, please sub. No rude comments or any crap because it uh, took quite a long time to make those. Okay, thanks. Bye.